Um, can I ask a question? Have any of you been to the College and Career Planning Center yet? Okay. Some yeses, some noes, great. So this is room 161, and we're located in the math wing. Um, so that's where you find us. Some students walk by and say, what's going on in that fancy room? Mm -hmm. um, because I'll, I'll take you for a tour in a little bit. But it is a, a new room. We developed it last year with Mrs. Trzanski. Some of you may know Mrs. Trzanski. She's a math supervisor. But she and I um, both felt that Colony needed a space where students could explore careers, connect with people, um, both inside our building and outside of the building, like professionals or Colony alums. Uh, to help, again, explore careers, look at colleges, and kind of set up action plans for what to do after you graduate from high school, right? Because really that's what it's all about. So Mrs. Trzanski and I were able to get the support of Mr. Ravalotti and a lot of other school professionals and the district and the board, and we developed this, this awesome room that we're going to talk to you a little bit more about today. So. Again, what is the College and Career Planning Center? It was developed last year. We wanted a place where students could explore careers and develop a pathway for success in a comfortable and professional environment. So how do you access the CCPC? That's what we call it, the College and Career Planning Center, the CCPC. So you might access the College and Career Planning Center during our open hours and much like a library, it's a place where you can kind of drop in as long as it's staffed. So each week on Aspen, we list what's going on in the College of Career Planning Center. So if you go to Aspen and you click on uh, the high school page and you read through like the different announcements, and it'll say College and Career Planning Center and you click for the schedule, okay? So if you were to go to Aspen, you would find this, which is our upcoming events list, and it just kind of tells you what, what's going on in this room every week. Everywhere. It's not fully staffed yet, hopefully someday it will be, um, but you'll find that you can pop in during open hours during the school day, during like maybe lunch periods or after school. And when I say open hours, that's really open to anything. So you may want to come down and work on a college application. You may want to explore Naviance, um, which is our college and career development software, and you can explore different careers on Naviance. You could do an interest inventory here. You may be interested in a part-time job, but you don't know how to find a part-time job. So you can come down and look at our jobs board, and you can ask me, and we can talk about how to get a job, how to get your working papers, and if there are any jobs or part-time jobs that we know about that we can try to connect you with. Okay? So that's one way that you can open, or you can access rather the College and Career Planning Center through our open hours. Another way you may access this room is through a classroom presentation. So Mrs. Trzanski and I work with the staff here and the faculty to kind of try to get an idea of what you're doing in the classroom and how we can enhance that in that room, in this room. So for example, last year, um, the FBI came and we coordinated with the criminal justice classes to bring in the FBI and then the criminal justice classes came to the center, the CCPC, and listen to what it's like to work, what a day in the life of an FBI investigator is kind of all about. So that's an example of how we work with classes. Uh, another example is that we had um, someone come in and talk about data analytics for Mr. Rosenberg's math classes. Okay? There, we also do other presentations on health careers um, and a variety of other careers as well. So your teacher may have something coordinated already with the CCPC and may bring you down um, during a class. You may come to the College and Career Planning Center to meet with a coach. We've had coaches come in that want to speak to our students about athletics and they come into this room and it's just a place where they might uh, meet and do some kind of recruiting if you will. You might meet with a college representative here. You might meet with a, a future employer here. So again, this room is kind of a space where you can do anything college and career related. Um, you might come to the College and Career Planning Center for our College and Career Club that meets uh, every other Tuesday after school. So we do have students who are interested in, you know, more than uh, just 
picking a college, they want to know all about it. So um, we do things like resume writing and uh, interviewing skills and how to apply for financial aid and all that kind of stuff in our college and group planning club. So that might be a reason why you access. So really, this room is about anything college and career planning oriented. It's really for you all. Um, and for the teachers, and again, just to help you guys learn a little bit more about what you're going to do after you graduate. Okay, so at this point, I'd like to take you on a little tour of the room, okay? So over here, we have our upcoming events board, and just like it sounds, uh, upcoming events list different things that are going on um, both in this room and outside in the community that is college and career related that you might be interested in doing. Okay, so if there's an open house at a school or an open house at a skilled trades training facility or uh, a job fair or something along those lines, you might find it on our upcoming events board. Okay, in our bookshelves here, we have a growing <laughs> um, group of books that uh, are college and career related. So that's something that we're working on. Over here, we have the job opportunities board. Um, so any type of part-time job that you might be interested in, you might find a part-time job listed on the job opportunities board. You can also ask me during open hours if I know of any different upcoming uh, part-time jobs. In fact, I was just notified last week that a villa and Beltrone, which are local uh, assisted living facilities, they're looking for runners, which are, they work in the dining room, they're dining room runners. So what they do is they run out food to the, the guests that are staying there and they get their drink choices and things like that. It's a decent paying job with good hours. It works great for students. So if any of you all are interested, come and see me about that. I can try to get you connected. Um, but that board, again, is our job opportunities board. And so that's where you'll find information about job opportunities. Uh, then over here, you'll see our student sectional. And we picked out a sectional for this room because, first of all, it's fun. Who doesn't love a sectional at high school? And second, second of all, it's very, um, it's transitional. So we can use it for a variety of different purposes. So if you're um, interviewing with a college admission professional, for example, you can pivot the chairs so that you're in a face-to-face -face discussion with them. Or if you're meeting with a potential employer or something along those lines. So it was a very purposeful piece. Um, and again, we want it to be not only professional in this place, um, in this career center, but we also want it to be uh, comfortable, right? We want students to like it and want to be in the room. So, um, over here we have our skilled trades wall. Uh, the skilled trades careers are really emerging, and we want our students to know all about what types of opportunities are available to them. So, the wall will provide some insight, but we've also, again, had classroom presentations. Um, by skilled trades professionals talking about what kind of opportunities are in that area. So, uh, in particular, we focused a lot on apprenticeship programs, which are programs where uh, students graduate from high school, they apply for an apprenticeship program, maybe in construction or welding or sprinkler fitters, for example. Um, they put sprinkler systems in buildings. So they apply for apprenticeship pro an apprenticeship program and for five years, they're trained free of cost, so it's not a like college where you pay for college. An apprenticeship is where they pay you to learn about the trade and work at the same time. So we feel that it's important for students to know about those opportunities, right? Because everybody's path is different. Some students may want college, some students may want a trade, okay? So we do that as well. And then the last board is just a little bit of an overlap, okay? We have this great, um, interactive television that the district provided us with and you'll see right now on the on the television we have our uh, Twitter and our Instagram and again at Colony CCPC we often will post upcoming events uh, part-time jobs that we know about things along those lines so you should really try to follow our Twitter account uh, to kind of keep on top of what's going on in this room Okay, and then lastly, we have these great uh, tables. We have high top tables, and we have the regular kind of classroom tables that are all really functional. They move around great, and they're just really professional 
and at the same time comfortable for our students. Um, so that's the tour of the, the CCPC, the, the fancy room as they call it. Um, and that's a little bit about what we do in the College of Career Planning Center. And I'm hoping that you all will come down and access it. Um, and feel free to ask any questions that you have about the room.